Hey Street Outlaws fans today, we're diving into a story that's got everyone. In the racing world talking a story of grit glory and ultimately a surprising. Who is Monza Johnston? Goodbye, I'm talking about none other than the legendary Jerry Monza Johnston. Buckle up because what I'm about to share will take you through the twists and turns of Monza's life, his racing, career, and the heartbreaking reason behind his departure from Street Outlaws. No prep king now, let's rewind a bit and paint the picture of who Jerry Johnston really is. Is born on May 12, 1959, in Arkansas City, Kansas, Monza was destined for greatness from a young age. Cars weren't just a hobby, they were a passion. A way of life, he was that kid who grew up with grease-stained hands probably tinkering with engines before he even knew how to ride a bike. While much of his early life remains a mystery, he's a man of few words after all what we do. Know is that his talent behind the wheel was nothing short of extraordinary for over three decades. Monza was a force to be reckoned with in the Midwest racing. Seeing he didn't just participate in races, he dominated them. This wasn't just Monza on street outlaws. A man who raced this was a man who lived and breathed speed, and that's exactly why when Street Outlaws was first created Monza was an obvious choice for the cast. His reputation on the streets was already legendary, but the show catapulted him into a new stratosphere of fame. Fans loved his calm demeanor off the track and his ferocity on it. He wasn't just, just another racer, he was the real deal, a symbol of what street racing was all about from 2013 onwards. Monza was a staple of street outlaws, consistently ranking among the top five. Racers his 1972 Chevrolet Camaro, nicknamed Sinister Split Bumper, was a beast that left competitors in the dust. And fans in awe, and that nickname Monza. That's a tribute to his very first car, a 1957 Chevy Monza, which earned him the moniker that would stick with him for life. But let's not forget behind the wheel behind the nickname was a man who was surprisingly quiet reserved even. Some might say intimidating with his big personality and larger than life presence. But those who knew him well would tell you that Jerry Johnston was as down to earth as they come. He wasn't about the glitz and glamour of reality. Why Monza quit? TV, he was about the thrill of the race, the roar of the engine, and the rush of crossing that finish line first now. Let's get to the part that's got everyone talking. Why did Monza decide to leave Street Outlaws No Prep King after unveiling a new car that had fans drooling with anticipation, it seemed? Like Monza was geared up for yet another triumphant season, but then out of nowhere came the announcement that sent Shockwaves through the community Monza was stepping away from the show in a tweet that left fans both stunned and heartbroken Monza revealed that despite having the perfect car to compete, he wouldn't be joining the season and why the circumstances, as he put it, just weren't right what circumstances you ask. Well, Monza hinted at one of the harshest realities of the racing world budget. Constraints, yes, even for a legend like Monza money plays a crucial role in whether you can keep competing at the highest levels. It's a reminder that behind every great racer is a team of budget and the cold hard reality of the costs involved. It's not just about speed. It's about the resources to maintain it. Now we don't know if Monza will return. In future seasons, maybe this is just a conclusion. Pitt stop a pause before he roars back onto our screens. But one thing's for sure, Monza has left a mark on street. Outlaws that won't fade anytime soon. Even at 60, he's amassed a net worth of $500,000 with a career spanning over 20 years in the industry. He might be aging. But if you ask him, he'll tell you he's still the youngest 52-year-old you'll ever meet. And honestly, who are we to argue with that the man is timeless? But what truly sets Monza apart isn't just his skill or his car collection. It's his spirit. He's the embodiment of what it means to love what you do to pour everything into your passion, and to walk away with your head held high when the time comes as fans were sad to see him go, but we also know that whatever Monza does next, it'll be done with the same intensity, the same dedication that made him a legend in the first place. So here's to Jerry Monza Johnston, a racer, a legend, and a man who will always be remembered for his incredible contributions to the world of street racing. We wish him nothing, nothing, but the best in whatever comes next. And there you have it, folks, a look into the life and legacy of Monza if you enjoyed. This deep dive, don't forget to like, 
share and subscribe to our channel, and hey hit that bell icon too, so you never miss an update from us, keep racing.